Welcome back. Now, on the 3rd of August this year, the Ministry of Commerce issued a notification placing restrictions on the imports of laptops, tablets and computers with immediate effect. Now, this was later deferred till November on request of the industry players. Meanwhile, the India Cellular and Electronics Association has written to the government suggesting that for this IT PLI scheme to take root, it will take a period of one to two years for the companies to set up shop and to move the supply chains here to India. Joining me now for more on this is with us Mr. Mohindru of the ICA. Mr. Mohindru, thank you so much for joining us. Uh, sh share with us some context as far as the industry's understanding of these restrictions are concerned. Uh, you've written to the government saying that it will take about one to two years for the industry to have the supply chains move here, for having the facilities commissioned and for actually manufacturing to begin. Uh, are we to take that that's a call from the industry to defer uh, these import restrictions by a period of about one to two years? Uh, thank you for having me, Ashmit. It's a pleasure to be here. Now, let me clarify that this is an import management system. It is, uh, it is not uh, mm -hmm. any curve or any import curve. However, there are concerns. Some are real, some are imaginary concerns. Because we live in an uncertain world since the last few years, uh, ever since this geopolitical issues mm -hmm. have started. So actions have been taken, which are not, you know, conventional post WTO type of uh, uh, actions. And that's why there was a concern. And uh, the concern of the industry is, uh, is of very high concern for all of us. And that's why industry has been reassured that there are, it's just an import uh, management system. You know why there has been an interplay is because of the PLI 2.0, the amended PLI 2.0, mm -hmm. which is a very strong uh, policy, uh, a very uh, refreshed mm -hmm. and uh, spruced up with a lot of extra meat in it, uh, which has been rolled out. Now, that unfortunately, these two things have happened together. So there is a uh, you know, uh, mm -hmm. connotation sure. in the minds of some that the two are related. They are not. Uh, the policy mm -hmm. of the government is to take the industry forward on an incentivized program, which uh, continues for a few years. In fact, this policy has a headroom of two years. Mm -hmm. So you can start operating in any of those sure. uh, two years because you will need time to shift uh, sure. capacities, build new capacities, uh, do the partnerships, etc. So all that uh, is being done. And that is why we uh, yeah. informed the government about the concerns of the industry and uh, that, you know, these concerns should be allayed. And uh, they have been. The industry is feeling uh, now much more relieved that these were uh, concerns which have been sure. uh, taken care of. Uh, let me then ask you a supplementary question, Mr. Mohindru. One of the concerns that you had raised as a part of the broader industry concerns has been the fact that uh, there has been uh, uh, a slight dampening of demand. Uh, the sales that we saw in 22-23 financial year was around lower by 22%. First half has not been spectacular. We're down about 15% in terms of uh, total sales. Uh, given that there are these concerns, uh, would you in an ideal world perhaps have uh, this import management system being introduced perhaps a year or two from now, that will enable the industry uh, to perhaps take root here in the Indian market? You know, I can tell you with a lot of responsibility that we will not need this, right? This is only will mm -hmm. be required for trusted supply chain. Otherwise, with the PLI 2.0 mm -hmm. taking root, uh, we will be on a completely different trajectory. Mm -hmm. You know, you remember those days that... Uh, you know, the for building the mobile phone manufacturing, we had to uh, raise duties and so on and so forth. And today, uh, nobody is concerned about it, and people don't even remember that. That these are this is just passe. Uh, mm -hmm. The industry has become so strong at forty-four billion dollars of uh, mobile phone manufacturing that now we can just remove uh, mm -hmm. many of these duties, and uh, they will be uh, we'll be mm -hmm. fine. So the, these are things which will be uh, not even considered uh, down the road because of the strong sure. 
इंसेंटिव स्कीम ऑफ पी एल We're completely out of time, Mr. Mohindra. Just one final question for 30 seconds. Uh, any concerns? The big drivers for mobile expansion and mobile manufacturing have been Apple and Samsung. Both of them have not applied under the PLI scheme for IT hardware. Any concerns on that front? No, Apple had never applied in the smartphone PLI also, and uh, Samsung is not a, a big player in IT hardware. Right, Mr. Mohindra. Thank you so much for that context. But we'll continue this conversation with you, and we'll keep coming back to you for more perspective on this IT hardware PLI journey. Uh, but that's all the time that we have. It's a wrap on this edition of the News Center. News and updates will continue on the other side. Stay tuned.